we should start by celebrating our outstanding sons and daughters in their various areas, in their various fields. So with that, ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you to the third edition of the Ijo Merit Award. My daddies, my mommies, you're welcome. So quickly, we'll move straight. My name is uh, Michel Dao Bimenetang Sokumbri. I'm a very proud son of Ijo Nation from Bayasa State and Dejo State. You know, there's one thing I like about our tribe. You hardly see an Ijo man that is purely from one state. The chairman of this occasion, Royal Fathers, members of the High Temple, invited guests, distinguished ladies and gentlemen. I'd like to commend once again the organizers of this program. I'd like to also commend all those that came uh, for this program, those that were invited and those that were not invited. The John Nation, as we all know, is the fourth largest tribe and I think it is important, it is crucial that at all times we must come together as a people. Nigeria forgot us. We, the ghouls that lay the golden egg, Nigeria forgot about the joint nation. Today we are where we are because they forgot about us. And as a people, the best we can do is to continue to come together, work together, and see how we can always be on the same page. His Excellency has done so much by bringing our people together. When there is crisis in the IYC, it brings them together. He sets some people, eminent persons committee, to be able to resolve the issues. So that when the IYC president is speaking, the judge is not speaking. When the IYC president is speaking, the judge is speaking. When the Commissioner for Culture and the Joint National Affairs is speaking, the judge is speaking. And above all, when our leader, His Excellency, the Progressive Governor of Adia State is speaking, the judge is speaking. Having said that, ladies and gentlemen, I want to use this unique opportunity to congratulate all of you for coming and above all, those that will get in awards tonight. Having said that, ladies and gentlemen, I want to say here and now that Winston Churchill of Great Britain once said that England expects everyone to do his duties. In said way, ladies and gentlemen, the John Nation expects everyone to do his duties. What the President Humbre is doing is his own part, his own contribution to the development of the John Nation. And so it's same way, all of us should look out for one thing or the other to do so that your name can remain in the annals of history as far as the joint nation is concerned. Having said that, let me, for and on behalf of His Excellency, the Governor of Adia State, declare this event open. Thank you and God bless you all. Thank you. During the Alamesia regime, she was like the chief security officer, a woman for that matter. So ladies and gentlemen, please, let's put our hands together for Reverend Mrs. Jane Allen. I want to say a little about our job culture. I'm not an academician, but I want to say practically about the job culture, especially as it regards women. And the job woman in those days hardly opens her head, except the young ones. As long as you are a young man, you will love. So I want that love to spread among us. The love of your fellow young man should spread. I'm surprised these days that we only want to pull. If I'm not there, no young man should be there. If I'm not there, no young man should be there. It's a very bad habit we have cultivated. I don't know from where. I want to plead with we, with few of all that are here. Wherever you see an angel man and a young woman, see what you can do to help yourself. A job, a song, a song means truth as you all know, they see. Let's be all kind and give a sincere 
Like, I'm Dr. Clarkson Ariboa, your son of Delta and Bayasa State. What is development? Time will not allow me to go to encyclopedia of development. It could be Britannica or Americana encyclopedia. But development, at the simple dictionary we put it, is growing from embroidery stage to maturity. If you look at the tribes in Nigeria, why some tribes are backward? Because we never took the importance of spiritual self-development. Another one, education is wrong. Association. 
I commend you. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of the Ijo Ladies Association, I want to thank the organizers of this great occasion, promoting Ijo women. And as our founder, Mrs. Jane Alec, had said that she founded this association about 40 years ago. And this association is still waxing strong. We want to give this award to you, Dr. Felix Twadolo, for your great achievements towards the Niger Delta people. Thank you very much. I wish to dedicate this award to the Niger Delta youth everywhere who are meaningfully aching out something for themselves to better society, not for selfish reasons, but to contribute to the development of the Niger Delta. Ah! Those who were able to make it, even though I go behind, 
I know very well that their spirit is going here with us. In all, thank you very much and God bless you all. I'd like to let you know before the presentation, you may not know this. Uh, when I was general manager uh, in the former All States Trust Bank, Naiko Bank in Lagos, I used to be a account officer to your beloved husband in Lagos, yes. I want you to know this. And I'll come closer to you, man. Thank you. We love you, man. Yeah, all on behalf of Prime Minister Indigenous of Nigeria, I present this to you for your commitment to excellence in the job nation development. Congratulations, man. Thank you very much. Thank you, my dear brothers and sisters. Thank you for recognizing me. And I want to thank the Prime Minister Job Indigenous of Nigeria to give me this recognition. I'm quite sure that God Almighty is going to recognize you all in Jesus' name. And in the 2017 the Job National Merit Award, activist and struggle and humanitarian man of the year. It's no other person but his royal highness king, king and temple, Michael Tom. Thank you. 